We're all in this together. Thank you. What the governor's done is pretty remarkable so far. In terms of, you know, for Fort Myers Beach, instead of doing cement poles or wooden poles, we put up steel poles. And guess what? They all were sustained. They all survived. The wires survived. The poles survived. It cost more money to put them up, but they survived. We also know we put a lot of this under, like in California, we put a lot of this that we do underground. It costs more money. Put in a tunnel in. It survived. We've got to change the way we build and where we build. The question every community is going to have to ask, should we rebuild in this spot or that spot? Will it be able to withstand what's likely to come again? And that's a local decision. I think he before he called me, I heard him. work hand in glove. We have a very different political philosophy. And but he worked hand in glove. And he's been on dealing with this crisis. Completely lockstep, but no deal. Okay, so now we gotta go, guys. Press, press, we gotta go. We gotta go, guys. We gotta go. Are you considering anything like that for home buyers who are struggling? Uh, the answer is uh, that's something will be discussed. But look, the fact of the matter is, states like Florida, where they've had a lot of natural disasters because of flooding and hurricanes and the like, the insurance industry is being very stretched. We're gonna have to take a hard look at. it. Whether or not the insurance industry can be sustained. All right, guys, we gotta go. We really gotta go. Thank you, Press. Thank you, Press. Thanks for everything. Thanks for coming down. We appreciate it. I picked the food. Thank you. 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 Thank you, guys. All right, guys, we got a load. We got a load. Press, we got to go, press. Oh,